Welcome to the Computer Breakdown, an exhibit produced for the American Museum of Natural History's Hack the Universe event in 2014. This exhibit examines the components of a modern computer. A computer is a machine that follows a special set of instructions called a program. People write programs for computers to help them solve problems and to understand the world better. A program is a lot like a recipe you would follow to make a meal. Let's say you wanted to bake cookies. You would get ingredients like butter, sugar, and flour. Then you would follow the steps of the recipe to mix the dough and bake the cookies in the oven. In a computer program, the ingredients are pieces of information, or data. We call the instructions of a program code. But how does a computer work? What are the parts of a computer, and what do they do? The best way I can think of to describe the parts of a computer is to compare them to things you find in a kitchen. Someone has to gather all the ingredients and follow the recipe's instructions to bake cookies. That person is the chef. In a computer, the chef is called a central processing unit, or CPU, or processor. It's the brain of a computer. A CPU takes input, or ingredients, and processes them into output, like cookies. Where do we put ingredients in cold storage? And where do we put the leftovers when we're done eating? The refrigerator. The next part of a computer is just like a refrigerator. We call it a hard drive or hard disk. When the computer is ready to run a program, the chef, or CPU, will get ingredients, or read data, from the hard drive. The CPU will perform all of its instructions, then put the finished product back in the fridge, or write data to the hard drive. The last part of a computer is what we call RAM, or memory. Memory is like the kitchen counter. It's the area where the chef does all of his work. He puts all the ingredients on the counter and follows the instructions to chop or mix or cook. The bigger the counter, the more ingredients the chef can access at the same time, and all within an easy arm's reach. This is why getting more RAM for a computer makes it work better and faster. And that is how the three main parts of a computer work, the CPU, the hard drive, and the memory. Please feel free to tweet any questions at the Twitter username below. Thanks for watching.